What's up, YouTube? It's here for you, episode 6 of FTB Inventions. And so today we're going to get a couple things done and we're going to be going exploring. I really was looking forward to this episode. I did a lot of stuff this morning just to this episode and I'm very happy with myself. I'm keeping the jetpack off right now because I do not actually, actually, you know what? I can just turn off the engine. Just do that. So we're going to get some of this. This is one of the big stuff we got here. As you can see, we got, we're going to just kind of take everything out. So I'm going to show you some of the stuff we're going to be doing today, and it's going to be pretty fun. After I do, here's the thing, I'm keeping the one thing before we go exploring to last, because you're going to know exactly what it is we're doing, going to be doing working on, as soon as I make that item. So we're going to do the first thing, we're going to upgrade our tool station, with the di for the two, the diamond tool forge. It's just like a tool forge, I don't think it should matter between the difference between these two. But I wanted to do it that way. Obviously, you can see if I press an E, it does exactly that. So, now I'm going to attempt to remember what I'm supposed to do with this. And then it's a red, that's, the next thing we're making is a redstone furnace. We're going to put the tool forge back here, because so, now we got all this stuff, which is really nice. I think that's everything. It gives, yep, gives me that. The shuriken, which is pretty cool. But we're gonna add the redstone. Okay, I'm gonna have a moment there. I'm gonna place that in the wrong area. I will just need to find my pickaxe, which is kinda MIA right now until I figure out which chest I jumped in. I put it in the chest just because I didn't need it for a while, and I was like, and since I haven't been playing, uh, I took a break to take a quick nap. I didn't quite remember which chest I put in. Probably this one. Yeah, it was this one. I passed it, like, I passed it already. But right now, we're just gonna put that there. I don't think I'm gonna. Right now, I could use power, or I think it uses power or red. You can use. Can I use redstone, or is it not? But what I was told from is that this is an ability, the possible ability to even double the ores we're getting that's alongside that one, so that's why I decided to make it as well. Let's see, the next thing we're going to make if I me is the crafting table. So we're actually just going to type crafting so I can get the recipe for it immediately without having to really look for it too much. Oh, I forgot a chest. That's okay. That is our eight we need for that. And when I click that, that, and I forgot to craft the table as well. Oh, I'm doing bad. And I was so prepared for this. Wait a minute. I think that was the four I needed for the crafting table as well. Okay. Yeah, that was the four I needed for the crafting table that I need to craft first before I can actually make this. Which isn't too bad. We're just going to place this down for now. But but I believe I do they put an item in here or what do I put down? I don't know. Oh, I think what I do is I just put what I... I don't know what to do with this. I'll figure it out later on that. I'll be back in one second. Right, by that, we are back. Now, let's get to this. Now, we're gonna. I'm going to have to show you what I'm making at this point. You're going to see it. But that is okay. Oops, I put a little too much iron. And we're going to put that there. And we got our inscriber. Now, obviously, at this point, you should know exactly what we're going for. We are going for the Emmy systems. We're going to start working towards it. We're not going to be able to finish due to... Um, I think it's that. Then follow up by that. Or that. 
There, up there, it's got it. Why do I have a charged? Third score, score. Oh, I remember exactly why I have this. And we're gonna do that, followed by this. And we got our meteorite compass. Now everything is built pretty much at the moment. We're gonna put the small stuff back in here like this. And there is a reason we're doing this. We need to find sky stone, stone chests so that we can get so we can get presses so that we can actually make our ME system. So first off, we're gonna start looking for what we call a meteor. So we're gonna first off, we are gonna have to turn our jetpack back on. I do have four. This, I did. Uh, what's great though is I have the 400k upgraded. I have the 400k up, upgraded with the jetpack that's upgraded to 400k off. So it's up to 400k off, which is really great, especially when I want to travel distances. I'm just gonna do this until I get over here, and then I'm gonna start walking in a random direction. So what I'm gonna do is this. I don't really want to show the entire travel distance. So I'm gonna do a little bit of talking before I try, I go and start cutting until. I find find them, but one like we said, my big updates I'm doing is there is gonna be a new series coming out soon. I am doing another double episode. Like I said, it's gonna be a kind of late tonight because I do still have to record the Rocket League episode. But after to and as of tomorrow, I will be recording. Actually, I might record it tonight after I finish rendering both the videos and uploading them. I might. Sorry, lagging a little bit there. I might actually still be go and record that episode. So it's gonna be a little surprise episode series for this series, so I know it's a little insane to do three a series in a short period of time, but I do feel that we can do it. And because I feel strong enough that we can do it, we're going to do it. At the moment it is just doing um spinning around because it doesn't detect a meteor. And what I've been, what I've looked up is that the meteors are already generated. It's actually generated during roll gen. It's not something that happens during roll gen, so we just kind of have to find them type of thing. So we're going to cut for, cross this river, well, this area. Mostly because I want to pick up that, I want to pick up those sugarcane. But I think at this point, I do want, so since I told you the major thing about what uh, the new series that's pretty much the main thing i want to talk to you guys about letting you guys know is that there is going to be a new series out it's been done before but and i did do a series on it before originally but i had to due to computer issues i ended up having to re delete everything and restart everything so i did lose all the work so i'm going to restart the series it is the uh, should, you know what? i'm going to tell you guys it now it is the fallout 4 series i'm hoping but by the end of I want to say it's going to be end of August. We're going to start getting the DLC for it, so that we can have extra stuff for it as well, not just the regular gameplay, which is going to be really nice. And I think that's one thing big I want to do. But I will be back when I find a me find a meteorite. So I will be back. Okay. Um, I didn't really wasn't even flying that. I literally took a second from flying over there. I flew to fly and I saw this. I'm like, little chest here. I did already open it, so I know it's hopefully safe to take. I think if I empower this with the anvil upgrades, it does give me an ability to, what's it called? Because I can't put that there. Uh, I believe if you get it, you can have it so it doesn't, if it helps prevent fall damage. What's that? I'm gonna follow it, cause that. Am I not meant to hit it? I'm sorry, little guy. I don't think we're meant to hit it. We'll leave it alone. I'm just gonna leave it alone. We maybe weren't meant to actually hit that, so hopefully. We don't die for that, so that's okay. We'll be back once again. I'll be back once I find a meteorite. I just want to show you guys what I found right there. And we are back. We are I finally found a meteor. I found out the issue was that I hadn't actually spawned one, made it so that it could actually spawn. 
So that was the issue. So this hopefully is the spawn point. Actually, I'm just gonna do this. And hopefully we will find it. So we're just looking for the center right now. And hopefully we can find the center, because hopefully we'll get the item we need. Well, items we need. We need quite a few items. Let's see if we can find it. We gotta find the center in order to, uh, to find it. And hopefully we can, without killing ourselves. Oh yeah, lava won't spread because of the fire tech rule. I did change some fire spread rules so we don't accidentally kill ourselves doing something stupid. Which is a possibility. Surprised we haven't found it yet, so this is thing. Whoops. Now I wanna go this way. It definitely we're definitely towards the center of this. It's not a we're it's not near the center. We definitely passed the center at some point. So we're just gonna go and do, go from the top again and start wiping out some of this and see if we can find it. We haven't found it yet, but let's see. Definitely haven't found it, but we definitely found plenty of gotten plenty of sky stone, which is supposed to be for a good use for decorative use, which is kind of cool. Okay, we're gonna go and we're gonna block out the source of these lava because that's this is annoying. And that should deal with the source blocks. Uh, no. So I got a couple lying around. That should do with most of the source blocks. You know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna get it. I'm just gonna get a bucket of water. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, we're back. I removed all the lava. Well, I didn't really remove the lava. It's more of I just took water to it and cooled it off enough to make a layer. Hopefully, we should be a little leisure on us. Without touring too much about falling into it. Let's see if we can still. Oh, I will have to. Ah, uh, my pickaxe broke. I'll be back in a minute again. Alright, after quite a lot of mining out of this, I finally found it and we only got the calculation for us. That is sad. That is really sad. So. I'm gonna head back home. I'm because I forgot the compass. I need, I need to get that so I can find the next one. I'm thinking that because we got one of them down, it won't be as difficult finding the other ones. Now, what ends up being is that I have to actually go and. How the best way to put this? The best way to find them, as I now have to go, I have to physically go to a new chunk that I haven't gone to before. Due to the fact that I, when I made the world, it didn't, that's not glitchy whatsoever. I never had it in a setting so that it could, meteors could actually generate. And that led to, so anything I basically have, well, any section I've generated, cannot spawn immediately. But one anywhere I haven't actually been to yet has that chance to. Oops. There we go. I'm going back up this way. Oh, boy, I'm watching something. I forgot about that. Whoops. But any place like I haven't been to yet has a chance that it can generate. Like if you look at my if you're looking at my inventory screen where you, my hop bar, you can see the, my meteorite compass spinning. But it's only spinning slowly. That's because I have been it had this not a meteor here, and because of that, it's like it, these chunks are kind of loaded. Oh, as you can see now, the compass is now pointing someplace. 
And so it means this might be a meteor someplace around this area. Hopefully not too far. And we won't have to go too far. But I'll be back when I do find that meteor. Alright, we found it. It took a little while going down. It kind of had to vein mine down a bit. Oh, actually, it kind of vein mined up. Down, it dug down and vein mined up because I literally found the chest right there. Uh, calculator press. I think that's the one we have already. We got a logic press. An engineering press. It's guys down. <laughs> like... You can take that, because I think the chest is actual chest, which is nice. And I don't know how much of this here, but we're gonna pick this up, and I'll be back once I get it all, so we can actually start finding the next mine. Actually, we're gonna head back to the we'll head back to the base, and then go to the next work on the next one. That way, that way we can store some of this stuff. So I'll be back with our next next location. Okay, we're back. So all we do need is the silicon press, which is hopefully gonna be in this one. But there is no guarantees in that one. Hopefully this will be kind of a small one. And we don't have to drain mine a lot of it. Which it looks like it's going to be I found the chest. Wow I, it's actually in this one. That's funny. Well we'll take that. So we are done looking for this, but we are going to main mine this out. I know that there's actually other stuff that you can get in this, but right now we don't really need to do that. And we talk right into water. Main mine right out into water, which is fine. I do just want to take this because I think, like I said, decorative. It looks awesome. So what I'm going to do is we're going to head back to the base. And we're gonna go and work on our MV system. I will be back when we start get when I get there. Alright, we are back. I am sorry for the delay in a lot of it. I actually had to go through a lot of processes just to get some stuff. So, we're gonna finish up what we were doing for that. It's not we're not gonna get too far into the system or what we're doing, but we are going to just get at least the basic startup stuff. And go from there. I did end up losing my tool for it because I, I didn't know that if I, I figured it only said effective tool, I didn't realize it meant when I said that that it meant that if I didn't use it, I was going to lose it. So, it happens. So, we're going to start building the stuff we need. So, we're going to go into the table and we're going to do that. Carefully, the press is right there. Why is it not going? Pressing turn. Oh, I got to make another turn. Since I need to make. Why is this not working? Okay. Oh, I don't have. I know what I. I do need one thing. Didn't have those. Enemy terminals would help if we may have made this. Enemy terminal, grab the other one because this is actually what we need to make anyways. We need to make one extra one, so I don't know if this terminal. Interface terminal. I think we can do this and keep interface terminal, which allows me to work it's similar to this, so we should be a little good. So what we're gonna do is this. And that enemy terminal. Make one of you. Uh enemy controller. Oh, I'm forgetting everything today. Need those. Alright, well, let's try one more time. This time it should work. And you. We got you. So I think what we can do, what we're gonna do is this. So we're gonna dig down here. 
would be helpful. And we do need the power supplies. Actually, I don't really need to go too far. So what I can actually do is just put that right there. It should start getting some power eventually. We're not going to stress too much about that. Um, put you there. And we're going to put you. Hmm. I think this does actually work with that, but that's okay. Okay, I actually have to escape out of this. This will get power in a second or two, but we do need to make a bus for that, which we are going to do now. Which I need 1k memory, which requires you. You. I don't have redstone for that, so we're going to have to go and make another one, because I guess I, I, you know what, I probably didn't make one for it. I am so good at this. Doing last minute stuff. Put you here. I don't need the calculator press. I need the logic press. And I need the silicon press. But I need, the, actually, I need more redstone anyways. So it's just for the, yep, there it is. There we go. That's some power for that. Logic press. Okay, we're gonna just. We're gonna do that part while we get cold far. <laughs> like I said, I'm, I'm, it's late at night for me at this point. This will work to some extent, but this part doesn't give any storage. So all it basically is gonna be good for is simply crafting. So turning out this is useless at this point. We don't need that. But it's not a big deal. We have our power source going with this. We are starting the ME process, which is really nice. We're gonna do one last of this, and then we should have enough to make one K story. We're gonna upgrade this later in. I'm gonna probably what I'm gonna end up doing is upgrading these off screen and getting that set up. Is that something I want to do? No, let me see. I need one of you. You I totally forgot about the quick glass. Let me get that quick glass. I have one. I think I have stuff for that. Let me just make sure it's not quick glass in here. No, it's fused quartz. Not quartz glass. That's okay. I actually have enough to make it naturally, so... There we go. That's what I wanted to do. We're gonna do that. Make a one quick 1k storage drive. That's good. And we are going to activate you. And now we can start storing stuff in here. Now the best part is, even though it has a, well, we can let me look at this. Even though it has a storage of 1k, about 1k, it only can hold 63 different types of items. Now how much of one item it can hold is still limited to the, the 1k storage is basically in that say, I, it can hold the 1k storage of storage of one item. Or, but, it can only hold up to 63 types of items. Lord of the it can hold a decent amount, but it's still only going to hold up to 1k worth of store juice. So, but that is the end of this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, especially for more content. And don't forget to know else there's going to be a new series coming out. Enjoy. I love